What is up, guys? This is Clinton at the Young Enthusiast, enjoying a nice Sunday after we had some severe storms and a couple people died yesterday. So, yeah, that's pretty crazy. Uh, everybody in the South pretty much remembered me, uh, knows about the storms. It basically hit most of the Southeast and it, it pretty much did some damage everywhere. Uh, it didn't do that much here. But it was very, very, very windy and very stormy. Probably the biggest storms we had in a while. But what I really wanted to talk about today isn't the storms, but it's the sunroof deflector that I put on this car a week ago. Even though we've had all these bad storms, this thing is still on here, right? After the bad storms we've had, it's still on here, and it's still on here tight, too. Like, really? I didn't even install this thing properly, right? Just the corner, just the edges are the only things that have been installed. I don't even have the uh, middle part installed, because I couldn't, <clears throat> I forgot to do it. Even then, after all that, it's still, it's still on there. I've, it's been pretty good. Uh, I know turbulence has definitely gone down on it. Like, I can actually open up the sunroof without letting down my other windows. And it actually feels pretty good. It sounds pretty good, too. Now, I am planning on getting another one of these things. Because somebody in the comments yesterday was saying, This is for your back window, bro. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to see what that looks like. I'm about to go to AutoZone today and see what happens. See if it looks just like that. Because I was actually on Amazon earlier today. And I looked up some stuff for Integris. And I saw a back window spoiler. And it actually kind of does look like this. It actually does kind of look like it. So, I'm going to see what happens. There's also a couple of things I need to go look for it. Uh, they're selling a lip spoiler that I can put on here. I know you guys might make fun of me for it, but if it looks good, I might keep it because, you know, I've always wanted a lip spoiler for this car anyway. I don't really care much for the big spoilers. Not really. Uh, I'm pretty much, other than that, that's pretty much what I'm planning on doing. Uh, I might sticker bomb it. Some person said they really like sticker bomb. I like sticker bomb, too. It's it's pretty good. I don't know if I'm going to do it with this one or not. I might put one sticker on it. You know. Probably just one. I don't know. So far saving up has gone well. Uh, I do have a little bit saved up. Hopefully after income tax. If I don't get screwed over by the health penalty. Which I think ended last year. I should be good. I earned a decent amount of money. And I spent a decent amount of taxes during my paycheck so wish me luck on that part well this is just a little update about this uh this uh wind deflector really still on here still doing great and this is kind of i don't know what's wrong with this damn thing right here but i hope you guys from alabama and the southeast are safe uh Hope the rest of you guys are enjoying your Sunday. Uh, just a little quick update. If you guys want to see more of this car, I do plan on doing a little bit more with it. Uh, I couldn't get to go to uh, Cars and Coffee yesterday because, as I said, yesterday it was storming, so I wasn't able to go. So maybe I can get some more car content soon. I don't know if there's any car events coming on. But, yeah, that's pretty much all I got to say. This is Quentin Gooden at the Young Enthusiasts, and I'll see you next week.